Welcome to this guide on customizing your XFC desktop to give it a modern and sleek appearance while supercharging your productivity. Whether you're using XFC on Ubuntu or any other Linux distribution like Manjaro, Fedora, or Arch, these tips and tricks will transform your desktop experience. Panel Customization Let's start by understanding the fundamental building blocks of the XFC desktop. Panels Out of the box XFC has a top panel that serves as your command center. It houses the application launcher, system tray, and lists your open applications. Creating a new panel. First, we'll add a new panel at the bottom for a modern twist. If you prefer to keep the top panel, you can customize it too. Here's how. Right-click on the top panel, navigate to Panel, and select Panel Preferences. Click the green plus icon to create a new panel, usually labeled as Panel 1. Drag and drop the new panel to the bottom of your screen. In the Display tab, set Automatically Hide the Panel to Always for a cleaner look, and check Lock Panel to prevent accidental changes. On the Appearance tab, you can choose the background style of the panel. You can choose Opacity as well. I will keep Background Style as None, Icon Adjust Size Automatically On, Opacity, Enter and Leave, 100. Let's start adding some applets. Go to the Items tab and click on the black plus icon to start adding some applets. You can add as many items as you want. Enhance functionality by adding applets like the Whisker menu, Application menu, Window menu, List of open applications, Places, File manager, Notes, Quick Sticky Pad, Screenshot, Indicator Plugin. Clock with date and time. Action buttons show log out, shut down. And show desktop. Fine tuning the panel size. You can also resize your panel to optimize screen real estate. Right click on the panel, select panel preferences, and go to the display tab. Adjust the row size pixels to your liking. To add some additional applications, you can open the application menu and right click on any application. Then click add to panel and choose panel one. For example, I have added some additional applications to panel one, Firefox, Thunderbird, LibreOffice Writer and GIMP Reordering items in the panel To arrange items right-click on the panel, choose Panel, then go to Panel Preferences Select the Items tab, and use the up and down buttons to rearrange items as per your preference Deleting the default top panel If you've created a new bottom panel and wish to remove the default top panel, proceed with caution. Right-click on the top panel, open Panel Preferences. Select Panel 0 and click the minus red icon to delete the top panel. Be cautious, as this will remove the default XFC panel altogether. Ensure that your newly created panel 1 is visible. Icons Customization now let's switch our focus to icon themes. Altering the default icon theme can significantly impact your desktop's aesthetics. Visit xfc-look.org to explore a wide array of GTK themes and icons. Find your favorite icon theme and download it. I have used the uniform icon set.
After downloading your chosen icon theme, extract the files. Create a .icons folder in your home directory and paste the icons there. Open the Appearance Settings and navigate to the Icons tab. Select your newly installed icon theme to apply the changes. Wallpaper Personalization A fresh wallpaper can breathe new life into your desktop. Explore the variety of wallpapers available on xfc-look.org, including the charming XFC mascot. Download your preferred wallpaper and set it as your desktop background. Settings changes for enhanced productivity. Let's dive into some XFC tweaks that can make your daily computing more efficient and enjoyable. Configure Whisker menu to launch with left super key. It is handy when you can just open the application's menu via the left super key or right super key. To configure the Whisker menu to launch with the left super key, open keyboard settings and navigate to the application shortcuts tab. Add super key and press OK. Switch categories by hovering mouse. Open the Whisker menu settings. Go to the Behavior tab. Check the switch categories by hovering. This allows for faster navigation within the menu. Add battery status and network data transfer indicator. There is two additional panel applet available which you can add to your panel. They are Power Manager Plugin and Network Monitor. These applets provide visual representations of your battery status, including percentage, and real-time upload and download data speeds for your network. The customizations we've covered here are just the tip of the iceberg. XFC boasts a wealth of settings that you can fine-tune to create a desktop environment perfectly suited to your needs and workflow. With these changes, you can enjoy a completely transformed XFC desktop that's not only visually appealing but also highly efficient for your daily tasks. Thanks for watching, and we hope you found this guide helpful in enhancing your XFC desktop experience.